Life is blocking your blessings If you so worried about me get invested Bitch, I'm a business, you wanna get in it Go put down your phone and pick up a pen I understand you thought you were smart Blind ain't the blind, you're all in the dark I know you used to see a mediocre I know the bar getting lower and lower Wanna constrict me like a boa Snake in the grass, but I got the mower I went and put the city on my shoulders They got my name at the top of the totem They know about me cause somebody told them Bitch, it's off, you know I'ma fold them He said I'm what's up what's up what's up everybody what's up what's up what's up everyone i'm just here with a quick little tap in rundown energy i'm pulling before i forget okay (laughs) okay somebody's been bragging you hear me somebody's been bragging and still talking about you this could be somebody you currently messing with right now or somebody you used to mess with not too long ago or not so long ago, okay? But this person be talking about it. I, it gives me like y'all could have been around the same group or same community. I don't know what setting. It could be a church. God darn, it can be a damn job. It can be whatever group y'all got going on that y'all have outside of work, hobbies, whatever, right? All right. And I feel like somebody also be running back telling their friends, like, that's the wrong thing to do, men and women. They're going back bragging on your shit. Like, they are giving them details, the details. And you know what I'm saying? How they're describing the feeling or the moments y'all have, okay? So... Especially if this is the first time y'all got intimate, okay? This person is talking about every time you get intimate, man. This person be on a whole nother cloud, cloud nine type shit. They be just as happy, chipper, and every goddamn thing. You hear me? But they talk a little too goddamn much. Like, they are telling people about stuff. And then some of y'all, like, telling, like, really, like, gloating and shit. And somebody feeling some type of way, like, somebody looking sideways. If this a guy, some of the guys want to, like, damn... You know what I'm saying? Like, shit, they he fuck up, I'm coming next. Like, you know what I'm saying? Some of his female friends that they don't know that low-key like them, and they sitting here talking about this person, talking about you, and bragging about this shit, right? And and just talking about it. So now this person, you know, I feel like they low-key like them in a way, but, you know, they never, like, said it. So now they feel some type of way. They used to people being in and out, in and out, but the way they're describing you and bragging about you, it got them really feeling like, damn, you know what I'm saying? So now you got people like looking at you sideways. For the ones who hang in the same group or same setting or know the same, you know, people, one another. Maybe you ain't in that setting no more. Maybe you then moved on and went somewhere else. Okay, maybe that person's still around some people or they got some he say I heard, you know, you know, such and such used to, you know what I'm saying? But anywho, they sitting there talking about the shit, like just talking about it. And then I feel like somebody already got somebody else, but in that same group of people that y'all know together, like mutual friends, they are still talking about the experience y'all had. You feel what I'm saying? And then it's like, it's crazy, right? And some of y'all, I feel like some people don't even believe that they even got you in that type of way because I feel like you're very private. I feel like you don't show much. Like you keep your shit very low key. You don't like a lot of people in your business and shit. But the way this motherfucker just keep talking and talking and talking. And then to their closest friends who they can really be deep with. Or maybe they got a homegirl or a homeboy, man or female. A home, that they really can tell they still because they, they want the other sex opinion or, you know, ideal. The way they keep, like, this, like describing that sexual experience with you or describing the experiences with you period or the things you do it's like everything you do is kind of like amazing like do you know they got them like <laughs> like they even like do their own thing they and they hold they you know this person just gloating and bragging a little bit and they got their friends even kind of like jealous to the point you know what i'm saying and some of them don't even know who you are from adam and eve and he's showing them pictures or she's showing them pictures like yeah them right there right there you know what i'm saying but it's giving me somebody who's just talking and, it's, and and they gloating you up and bragging so hard. Or they so amazed and all about you that it got people around them or people who also know you too feeling some type of way or looking some some type of envious coming or jealousy coming over them. But it don't matter. You know what I'm saying? 
they making you feel high and mighty, and they thinking like, well, damn, they ain't all that now. God damn. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> it's giving me stuff like that. But you got somebody who's amazed that you gave them a chance. But I don't know if it's still in, like some just, like I said, some you don't deal with no more. And they still there like, dang, we used to, you know what I'm saying? They was bringing like, damn, that shit was good. It's still like, bro, that, that shit got me, bro, when I say good. And it's like, the girl is just like, girl, when I tell you that nigga had me like, you know what I'm saying? Like, they just talk, they just can't get over it. And then the way they used to, they're like, man, and then they treat me so good, like, Man, they got their shit together. It's like they they hold their own, man. They don't play. They take well good. If they got children, they take well good care of their kids, okay? This person be getting that money. They travels. You know, this is like different. You know, y'all got different situations. But when I say this person glow in the shit, and, and if you getting, like, new, like, requests and f- friends and stuff on your other social media, you know, this guy really showing you who you are. And they feel like somebody... Happen to, I don't know why I get like somebody know the same person who's been gloating with you or they heard about you before. Somebody probably run across you or y'all walk in the same city as now. I don't care if this being like months ago. This person talked about you and showed your picture and gloated you so much. I feel like somebody is in the same area as you. I don't, and this could be something like somebody talked about you years ago, like I heard about you. I heard that name before. I heard that name. And then they remember. When that person used to bring you up all the time, and they were like, their face looked familiar. They remember when that person showed you their picture, showed them they, your picture. So now you got like a, somebody you don't know, but they know you, okay? And and the way you showing, you showing, you looking like the person. You looking like more than what they can explain. Like they can see why this person was so at all over you, okay? And then, like, seeing you in person is getting them, like, you know what I'm saying? But I still feel like they would not tell the other person that they have seen you because I don't know. I don't know. I guess they're trying to do, get some inside investigating or trying to figure out, like, from you know, I don't know why people do that. You know, you got them kind of curious, like, if this, you know, like, who's this person? Why do this person think they're so, but they seeing you in person. You get what I'm saying? I hope I don't sound like I'm confusing anybody. All right. But that's what it is, okay? Take what resonate, leave the rest. That's what I had to say before I forget. And I bet you, as soon as I get off of this, there's going to be some more shit to come to me. But it is what it is. All right, y'all. Watch y'all thoughts. Treat others like you want to be treated and don't be so judgmental. Okay, baby? You is one, whoever you are, y'all is one of the ones they talk about. When people are like, what's the best you had? You be the one. What was the best relationship? Like, who, who which the ones you lost? Like, which one you, um, you hate, you lost? Like, it, it's like that. Like, you know what I'm saying? You leave good impressions. That's all I'm going to say, okay? You leave good impressions. And you, and you like, really um, leave imprints on people, okay? All right, y'all. Thank y'all for having with your girl. I'm going to let y'all go, though. For real, though. I love y'all. Bye.
Cancer, Leo, oh my God, mental illness, vacation. Damn, Irv, let me get y'all out of here because y'all got me running over. Daycare worker. Some of y'all could be a daycare worker. You got a lot of signs, man. Damn, who y'all dealing with? Ex-boyfriend. Okay, that answer my damn question. Look at me, I'm all up in y'all shit, Irv sign. Hold on, hold on, one more, one more, and I'm going to let y'all go for real. Watch your thoughts. She feels like you want to be treated and don't be so judgmental. Somebody say they not you. And I feel like you like, return to Cinder. Return this shit to Cinder. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, you got to your energy. God damn, what y'all got going on, baby? It's like, whoa. Okay. All right, y'all. Thank y'all for vibing. Take what resonate. Leave the rest. Thank you, Earthstein. Peace. Love y'all. Hope this helped. Bye.